we probably saw all the salt on the roads even before the snow came in and apparently that can keep us safe. But where does all of that salt go once the snow melts? A meteorologist Michaela Lucero is here with more on the impacts that sodium chloride we put on the roads can actually have on our health and the health of our environment. Michaela. Hey ladies. Well, there is a big thing going on with that salt and the big thing is a little goes a long way. So look at this scoop or this coffee mug I've got right here. This is really all you need for an average driveway. Now WSSC water says that salt it ends up in our water systems, mainly in the Potomac and the Patuxent rivers. It runs off and ends up in the source water and we see it in there and we cannot we WSSC water cannot remove the salt in the treatment process, short of doing sweeping and very expensive treatment changes that we don't have funding for. The increase in salt can have a significant impact on us as humans and on the environment. Our drinking water can become saltier in taste and can develop an unusual odor. It's still safe to drink, but it could cause problems for people on low sodium diets or who are on dialysis. The amount of chloride or salt in our source waters has more than doubled in the past 30 years. So we know that what you do on the land affects the water. For the environment, the increased salt can harm the wildlife in the Potomac. For example, fish that can only survive in fresh water could have a difficult time thriving when the water becomes too salty. Aquatic plants and microorganisms can fall into the same trap as well. So what can you do? Be salt wise and remember these three things. Number one, shovel early and often so that ice doesn't form. Number two, less is more. It only takes one coffee mug full of salt to cover 10 sidewalk squares or the average driveway and three sweep it up. Any salt that's left over once the snow has melted can be swept up and reused for the next event. So either get your scooper out or get your mug and go out there and salt less. Yeah, you all remind us of that every year. I remember when Topper and Michaela and Caitlin started talking about the first time. I didn't realize you should sweep it up and use it yeah, again, but it's yeah. a great reminder. And now we know the health impacts too. Absolutely. And to have the visual. Plus, I feel like with all things in life, the advice is usually less salt. So yeah, <laughs> exactly. We'll take it. There's a through line there. Yeah, for sure. Michaela, thank you.